In our previous video, part one, we showed the primary difference between the Little Giant and the Hovabator incubators, that being the thermostat, the Hovabator being the mechanical thermostat, the Little Giant an electronic thermostat. Now we're going to show some more differences in the Little Giant and, and Hovabator incubators, and there are several. We'll start first of all with the Hovabator. We mentioned it's a mechanical thermostat. It looks like this. It's a wafer style. When you get this, you're going to get it in a small packet like this. It does not come installed, but installation is very, very simple. Set it into place in the metal bracket which is inside the Hovabator incubator. Screw the wafer into place. Set the lock nut at the right spot to set the temperature as we talked about in the last video. And you're set. It's really that simple. Not a big deal to install that thermostat. The little giant does come pre-installed. It's just ready to go. Plug it in adjust the knob, and you're good. The next big visible difference you'll see is the Little Giant has these large viewing windows, two of them. The Hovabator also has viewing windows, a little bit smaller, but still they do the job just fine. The viewing windows in the Little Giant will actually come out. So, for example, after your chicks hatch, you can take the window out to pull them out if you'd like. I find that to be a nice feature. The Hovabator windows do not come out. They are sealed into place. The density and the thickness of the foam in each of these incubators is a little bit different. The Little Giant is a little bit thinner and lighter density foam. The Hovabator is thicker and a little bit more dense. Because of the thickness of the foam, the wattage in the Little Giant is a little bit higher. The heating element is a 40 watt heating element. They both look the same between two, the two incubators, but this one's a little bit higher wattage, takes a little bit more power because the insulation is not quite as good. Also, because of those large viewing windows, the insulation there is not as good, requires a little bit more power. Keep in mind that when the incubator is running, it's not always using 40 watts because the heater is off a good share of the time. It cycles on and off. It's only using 40 watts when the heater is on. Another significant difference between these incubators is in the Hovabator incubator, it comes with a sanitary liner in the bottom of the incubator. So underneath the wire rack, there is this plastic liner that easily comes out. That has the water troughs to fill with water to control the humidity. And when you're done incubating, as you probably know, chicks can make a mess uh, when, they, when they hatch as well as uh, their first few hours, they can get kind of messy. This sanitary liner easily comes out. It's easy to clean, dry it, put it back in, and the bottom of your incubator is nice and clean, ready to go again. The Little Giant has built-in water troughs into the foam, but it does not have the sanitary plastic liner in it, so you have to clean the foam when you're done incubating. One last difference between these two incubators is the Hovabator incubator is a little bit taller than the Little Giant. If I put these side by side, you'll see the Hovabator is slightly taller. This helps facilitate larger eggs. In the Hovabator, there's an optional accessory you can purchase for goose rails. You can add goose rails to your egg turner and the, the ceiling is tall enough to facilitate goose eggs. In the Little Giant, if you were to do goose eggs, you'd have to take the egg turner out and simply lay the eggs on the wire mesh. You can still do that, but you wouldn't be able to use the auto egg turner, which you can purchase with the Little Giant incubator. Those are the primary differences between these two incubators. Our site, incubatorwarehouse.com, we offer combination kits of each of these incubators. You can get either one, the same price for the basic incubator and egg turner, the accessories you can add are the same. And the Hovabator has the option to get goose rails with the egg turner. The Little Giant does not. But that is the only difference in accessories you can buy with the two incubators. Also, the pricing for each of these on incubatorwarehouse.com is the same. Whether you buy one or the other, this, the price is identical. We have found they are both very successful incubators. You can make both of them very effective.